Hi, my name's Andy and I'm going to take you through how to use Weaver to manage shift handover reports. So the first section we're going to look at here is the form builder, uh, where you can customize your form to suit your unique needs. This is a template, uh, so it's entirely customizable to whatever you want to do. Um, we've got a number of Power BI dashboards embedded into the report to provide uh, the shift manager with information uh, about the last shift or any anything that they want to look at. Um, they can also we've also embedded in here the action items form as well, uh, so that can be loaded based on conditional logic. Uh, we're using multiple choice scoring fields to add product cycle times and then a, a calculation result field to uh, provide sort of the production goal uh, for optimized conditions. And you can add multiple products. We've got a section here for quality defect reporting where the uh, associate or operator is asked to pull 100 products off the line and then uh, report on how many critical and non-critical defects there are and you can have different conditional logic based on the amount of critical defects. A waste tracking report allows you to track the different types of waste that occurs during production. And then a downtime report where you can collect information around planned and unplanned, planned downtime, uh, the minutes, and, and all of that. Uh, there's also a number of different ad, uh, additional resources where it kicks the user out to a different form. Uh, so here's the actual shift report form. Uh, the shift manager can review stats from the prior shift and then select their shift and the line and area that they worked, worked on. Uh, the shift reporter, which would be that person. And then they can review any action items that are associated to their shift. So I'll select here the red shift and we are working on line one. Uh, so I can see that there's a company meeting next Tuesday. There's an issue with the capper machine and so forth. Uh, I can select that I'm planning to work on some of these and it kicks me out to the in progress section. And then I can also say that I want to add an action item, which loads the action item form uh, directly within the report. For the production report, I can add that we started on time. I can add the product and see the cycle time. And then I <clears throat> input the amount of production hours, which automatically provides me with an optimal unit goal. This is used for OE calculations. And then I add in my actual as well. I can do my quality uh, report right here within the form. You can see here I'm adding three critical defects and it provides a um, a link to a form that I'd need to go to if I added 10 or more. It basically says, hey, shut down the line and you need to contact the, pr the production quality manager. For my waste report, I can add in here, you know, that there were um, there was an issue with cans of this specific SKU. I can add in the quantity and the reason code. And for downtime, I can say that we had planned and unplanned maintenance issues and the amount of minutes and any information around that. Uh, for additional resources, I can add incident reports, abnormality reports, suggestions, and so forth. And then I can also add any notes or comments that I'd like to um, add to my report. All this information is captured in the in progress section uh, where shift managers or whomever has access to the section can review uh, the data. They can edit the forms as well. And uh, they can simply close this if there's no issues or if they want to, they can assign and add a due date and add any additional comments. The information is also obviously uh, captured in form reports. I'm just going to find the shift report form. And you can see that every submission is a row and every field is a column. And I can uh, review this information within Weaver and I can also download it as a CSV or Excel spreadsheet. And of course the dashboard is available just as a, as a report where you can review the information from each of the shifts. The shift handover report is just one of many solutions offered by Weaver. It's entirely customizable to your unique needs. So let us know if you have any questions.